Hi, everyone. Well, you know, Donald Trump went to the Butler, Pennsylvania scene where the tragic event of the assassination attempt was made back in the summer. And of course, it was an emotional experience. And he recounted it very movingly at the Republican convention. But he also said at the time, I will never talk about this again. And of course, typically in Trump form, because he is a liar, he constantly mentions it. And I don't mind that so much. But what I do mind, and what I mind his vice presidential running mate, J.D. Vance, echoing is that violence against Trump has been caused by the Democrats and all of their rhetoric against him. He's destroying democracy, etc., etc. Excuse me. Donald Trump has been talking in a violent tone against so-called not only illegal immigrants, but all immigrants. They're, they're poisoning the blood of America. That's Nazi speak for what Hitler was talking about, the Jews and gypsies and other people back in the day. This man one could say that his rhetoric caused the shooting in El Paso at the shopping center where the man admitted that he didn't want Hispanics invading Texas. Who is Trump to talk about things like this? And he's feeding this by continuing to talk about the Haitian immigrants who are legally here and what they are calling they're eating pets and, and now they're causing disease and apparently they have bad genes, all of these immigrants. This man is a racist scoundrel. And I do not understand why any of you would continue to support him. I know it's close in many of these states, but really, if you have any thought about keeping America democratic and out of the hands of this really horrible human being, you will endorse, as I am, Kamala Harris and Tim Wolfs.